So with Mercedes-Benz, it can often be said that these vehicles are really quite difficult to fix. You're throwing component after component at them and really not getting anywhere. Those really infuriating knock sensor faults. No amount of component replacement is ever going to resolve those issues. These are things that really only software updates are going to cure. In this video, we're going to cover the coding, the programming and the full diagnostic process to give you the tools to keep the vehicles out of the dealer franchise network. Why go for Mercedes? It's one of the most prestigious vehicle German brands that are out there. The vehicles obviously they span quite a few years now, there's plenty of them on the roads and even the newer ones now they're getting more and more complicated. The software that's inside these vehicles now demands such from a diagnostic tool that sometimes the aftermarket tools just can't reach. With the dealer diagnostic tool you're going to be able to one diagnose that problem really easy and simple and quickly. Number two, repair it to the correct specifications and recommendations by the vehicle manufacturer. And third and most important of all, you're gonna get that vehicle back to the customer, maximizing your profits and getting yourself a good reputation. So to start on your diagnostic journey, you're first of all gonna to need to register on the B2B portal. Most people think that actually this is a nice, easy, simple process. Once you've got B2B access, then you've got access to diagnostics. This isn't the case. The B2B portal access has many, many uses and many, many applications and layers to it. The first level of access being getting information and getting that digital service record capability. There are an additional four or five step processes on top of that to get you your dealer diagnostic access that you need. Those will be including standard diagnosis role, extended rights, ID now to do facial recognition, etc. So you'll need to go through all of those to get full capability. It can be quite time consuming because certain emails you will be sending out and you've got to really be on top of that ball and watching and monitoring those emails coming back. Failure to do so is that ticket might get closed and that means worst case scenario starting that process all over again. These tickets generally get closed within a 48 hour time period so it's really quite critical that you're on the ball monitoring those emails. We would probably recommend setting up a separate email address where that you can monitor that traffic in and out. Your account setup is going to be specifically individually personalized so every single user using the tool will need their own logins and passwords. They're also monitoring the IP address address of the system as well so again be careful where you use the system if you're mobile make sure that you actually notify Mercedes-Benz of your mobile diagnostic business otherwise they'll be treating you as a static workshop premises registration and dealer portal access so to get registered with Mercedes-Benz B2B portal there's some really bits of important information you're going to need to know those are VAT registered limited company you'll need a proof of premises and of course really important that you don't use any of the vehicle manufacturers logos or trademarks throughout your website or social media content. UK and European customers you're going to want to be CERMI accredited and CERMI approved and if you're in the US you're going to want to seek out the NASTF accreditation for security. B2B portal access and extended diagnostic rights can be available throughout UK, Ireland, Europe, America and Canada and also now for our friends in Australia. After your registration and you've got your access, you now need to consider the software and the hardware. Pastor is a great little entry point as it gets you from the aftermarket tool and gets you on that stepping stone to using the full dealer diagnostic software. Pass-through gives you probably about 80% of what you're actually going to want. You still need the same full registration process as you would do with the other systems. What you're really benefiting from with Pass-through is the ability to use a generic VCI with your own laptop as well that's provided. So really the setup costs are quite low. You're using a generic VCI with your own hardware and Mercedes-Benz specific pass-through software. The specific pass-through software is going to be Euro 5, which means you're going to be looking at working on vehicles from around 2010 to current. There are some limitations, however, depending on your pass-through device, as not all pass-through devices will support full DOIP. So moving on from pass-through, we've got the Zentry Diagnosis Lite. This is the perfect solution for our aftermarket workshops. Sentry Diagnostic Software allows you to do full pre and post scanning, guided diagnostics, those activation tests, those really, really nice live data views with real targeted actual values, gives you the ability to look at your wiring diagrams, your technical information, 
all in one place. You can even use the B2B portal for uploading your digital service booklet. What you're getting here with Diagnosis Lite is the ability to use the genuine VCI, as we've seen used within the dealer networks, but also gives you that flexibility to use your own laptop or tablet, which keeps those costs down. You're using the Diagnosis Lite specific software, the same open shell platform as used on the genuine dealer diagnostic at a fraction of the cost. It still maintains the pay-as-you-go business model, covers all of the vehicles from 2004 to the current DOIP architecture vehicles. So really that's giving you full maximum potential to get a return on your investment. What we're basically looking at is the Zentry pass-through software with a pass-through setup. This is generally, as I mentioned, a generic device such as the Cardac Plus 3 or the Bosch MTS6531. You'll then be using a generic standard laptop or tablet that meets manufacturer's minimum specifications. For laptop or tablet specifications, you really need to be looking at something like what Mercedes-Benz offer with their full Zentry kit for. So they offer a 1.6 gig processor, 16 gig of RAM, and a one terabyte solid state drive. This is the ideal scenario and the ideal solution, as that's what's been used by the vehicle manufacturers within their workshops with their full Zentry kit fours. We offer a range of really, really good, high performance, Dell rugged latitude PCs. And of course, there's always the option of the Panasonic FZ55 latest generation. With the Zentry Lite, because the vehicle coverage goes back to 2004, there may be additional cables that you may need to consider, such as the 14 pin sprint to cable adapter. This is great if you're working on light commercial vehicles and you've got a fleet of vehicles that you really need to maintain. This is an essential part of the kit that you really need to consider. You're gonna obviously need the LAN cable. The LAN cable obviously will give you that stable internet connection that you really need throughout the coding and programming and software updating process. And of course, really importantly, is the battery support unit. These vehicles can be quite heavy on the ampage draw, so we would recommend something like the GYS 121.12 CNT. This is a 120 amp unit capable of stabilizing that voltage up to 14.8 volts. On the B2B portal, you've got a number of different options for subscriptions. These are to cover things such as repair times or XOT, WIS, which is the workshop information system. You've also got Zentry tips, as well as your diagnostic software. All of these options can be purchased by the hour, the day, the week, the month, or a yearly subscription, whichever suits the business. Flexibility really is key with this software. You have the ability to swap back and forth as you have a good busy period, a quiet period, or you can actually have both types of subscription within your workshop. You could have a yearly subscription for your workshop information system and an hourly system for your diagnosis process or vice versa. With the way the dealer diagnostic software works, with all of the different codes and all the different licenses and various bits and pieces, it's really quite important that you keep your dealer diagnostic software up to date. Mercedes-Benz release updates once a quarter. So it's really important that you keep your software up to date as if you go two versions over, the system will stop working and your license key will become invalid. Mercedes-Benz also released what they call add-ons. Add-ons are the daily software updates that you really you need to be running every morning to make sure that your system is working at full optimum efficiency. If you're a busy workshop and you don't have time to update your software, the Maverick Diagnostic Technical Support Team are on hand to be able to process and carry out those tasks for you. That's available on a contract service or a pay-as-you-go service from as little as £99 a month. With the Maverick Diagnostics dealer tool support, you're gonna get one of our trained expert technicians keeping your systems up to date as and when those updates come out, which means you don't have to waste your time making sure the PC is on the latest version of software so that you can turn the vehicle around and get that back to your customer maximizing your profits and return on investment. I've done 30 years of dealer diagnostics all my information, all my knowledge that I've gained over these years has been put into this buyer's guide to make your diagnostic journey as smooth as possible. It's the only place on the internet that you will see all of this information in one place. Everything you need to know from getting started to owning, running, and where you can use this equipment and software. Our mission is to give you all the information and ammunition that you need to keep those vehicles coming back to your workshop. As the more complex and complicated these vehicles get, we want you 
to keep them out of the dealer and in your workshop. If you want more information or where to see the buyer's guide, visit maverickdiagnostics.com.